after the case operations uh, let's see what is next so from in 7.4 it's possible to use right auto join so till date you could do left inner join left auto join auto join but you did not do right auto join so if we had to do right auto, auto join then you, we used to swap the tables to the left side and we still did left inner join right that's what we did so let's let's see how it can be done in abap 7.4 We'll do the same thing. We'll comment uh, the existing code and then we'll write our new code on the top. So I'll, I'll write it 13 and then make it right outer <coughs> join. So we'll do select P. I'll tell you what P is. P works means client will select. We'll select valuation area. We be wky into table. We'll do a inline declaration data. Uh, we'll name it as uh, valuation. And then we have to write from table name is t001k as v write outer join. T zero zero one one WSP on valuation area B W K E Y equals to plant works. So what did we do here? So we are trying to join table T zero zero one K and T zero zero one W. So what is the on the left hand side? T zero zero one K is on the left hand side, and what is on the right? T zero zero one W. So if we do a join that is right auto join, then what we will do? It will look at the right side. So this is the right side. So it will look at the right side T001W and it will pull all the entries of T001W and look into this table. And then if it finds entry corresponding entry for T001K, it will include that also. If it does not find this, even the, then this will end, this will pull its value and leave the value of this table as blank. So, so right auto join means it is a union of this and this. Uh, if the entry is not here, even then it will pass blank for this. So let's let's see the uh, write something for the output and then we'll check how it looks like. So it will be more clear. So if psi is u b r c equal to zero, and if and then we'll loop and loop at l i again we have an opportunity to declare inline declaration into data i'll say what you will ls val i'll give different name sometimes we use wa sometimes ls val and loop and then i'll try to write a write statement all right our favorite write statement within pipe so what should i write here i'll say just say plant is what is plant plant is on ls underscore val underscore works and then evaluation arrays i'll just give a colon comma so evaluation area equals to you know the evaluation area so ls well what is evaluation area is b so they know it so they is smart enough now So it's B W K E Y. All right. Now we need to give a space here. Your space, your space, and a full stop. And then we can also. Um, so let's see how many counts were there. So what we'll do? Right. Uh, we'll say again a pipe. We'll start in a pipe. Number of uh, entries. Entries in internal table equals to we'll just use lines li valuation hope you understand this and then that is good all oh, right spelling is incorrect here that's the beauty of adt so while writing you are you know even before hitting the syntax checker right you know that something is wrong so i activated it now did it fail activation failed did it fail or it was from the old one let me 
okay it says that uh, incorrect nesting for the end if so let's check our end if if and if it is working oh it's not taking that if and is there did we miss some okay we missed here so let's comment this guy and now we should be good to go all right successful so let let me test it to f8 so this is the output let's see how many is the count count is 1048 okay so let's me go to the code again so we say that 1048 that means this table this table the which is on the right hand side it has 1048 entries and then it goes to this t001k and then try to find if it there is any corresponding entry for t001w if it's there it is included in the join if it is not there then that place will be blank let's see the output if we have any blank uh, on the on the plant side and i think there will not be because evaluation area has all the entries so i think we are good so everything is coming so let me show you in the table how uh, you can validate that so we got an uh, total number of entries is 1048 in this table and if you go to t01k it is 1095 and our output uh, was 1048 let me go to the down again so that means everything from this table which is on the right side has been included now if we change the code to say right join only so right join it means it is like inner join from the right side so if i do here uh, okay we will not be able to find the uh, difference because uh, right hand side okay let's let's try the output okay i'll do an f8 let's see it should be 1048 let's see see 1048 because uh, the right hand side uh, everything in this table is present in this table so therefore we did not see the difference so let's let's uh, to in order to see the difference let's change it to inner join now okay then you will be more clear i'll just make inner join inner join so when we do inner join what happens so and everything which is present here and present here will be shown right so if there is a some entry here which is not present in here then they will not be shown so it is a un intersection intersection of the two so let me execute it this time so let me go to the bottom see 1047 okay this makes clear okay 1047 so t001k is in the left hand side it has 1095 but the output we are getting is only 1047 that and, and how many were there in t001w it has 1048 but one entry in this table does not match with this table so so therefore it is only 1047 entries and if you see the output it's in 1047 so everything present in this and this both has to be included in an inner join right that's how we inner join works so whatever is present in this and present in this is a un intersection there and then that is displayed so now if i do an outer join so what is the what is your expectation so that means outer join okay left outer join left right left outer join left outer join so what we'll do whatever is present in here and whatever is present in here give it total so if here it is 1045 and here um, so it is 1048 and here it is sorry if it is 1095 here and it is 1045 here then we still need everything okay so if there is not something not present for this entry we'll give a blank let's check it i'll activate it and then press f8 this is the output let's go to the bottom control n see 1095 so how many were there um, in the table let's see this table so they were 1095 but everything was not present in t001w but still 1095 came in the output because it showed everything from this table and whatever was not available in t001w for, for those they kept it as blank let's find out if there is any blank entries here see for this here so the plant it does isn't blank here but it's still showing up so whatever is blank it is leaving it less blank got it so so anything what is present um, in both the tables uh, with the union that is that is the uh, outer join all right
so let's 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 check out the code now so i have prepared a small uh, explanation for this say say t001k has 1095 entries and t001w has 1048 entries so if we do an inner join and this is the left hand side t001k is the left hand side and t001w is the right hand side if you do an inner join inner join means whatever is present in here and here both where whatever is present in both the tables it should be shown here so this has 1048 and this has 1095 but only 1047 are common in both therefore the output is 1047 now left outer join so this is left this is right outer join means whatever is present in here and present in here it will show so if if something is not in this table for the corresponding value in this then it will be a blank so the output is 1095 because on left hand side 100 k has 1095 so 1095 entry has to be there but the values of some of the fields of this table may be blank if it does not exist but the number of entries in the select for the join will be 1095 now come the right join so this is left and this is right so right has 1048 and whatever is present in 1048 has to be present here okay so and those those combination will be shown so it will be intersection so 1048 whatever is there in 1048 is also there in this table so 1048 is shown and right outer join right outer join means this is the right hand side this is left hand side so everything which is present here and what is present here uh, and the corresponding here um, if it is blank still it will show means if there are 1048 here and there is a 1000 here still the total number of entries for this right outer join will be 1048 so because everything from this will be shown and if it has value for this table it will be included if it is not then it will be blank there so that is the right outer join so this is a course template for right outer join hopefully you will you can do uh, see how many entries are there in your table and then see the different output so just change here from right outer join to right inner join or uh, right join then right outer join then left join left outer join do this much and see the output it should be clear